So Magamba Network and Motor Republic are well known for uh, just giving platforms for creatives. Uh, you being a part of that, what do you think is the main drive for that initiative? Well, I think there's a there's a gap. Uh, mm -hmm. There's a gap in the there's a gap in the in, in the ecosystem, I guess. So mm -hmm. like when 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 people are thinking of businesses to support or in institutions that think of business support, yeah. think of agriculture, mining, right? Uh, creatives are always at the last yeah. uh, uh, tail end of. Of the, of the of the of the ecosystem, uh, and when budgets are cut, <laughs> it's the creative budgets that are cut first. You know, the public relations, the marketing. Yeah. So I think this space was born out of a need for to have to to, have, you know, to house creatives. Yeah. Uh, and how Motor Republic came to be was Magamba Network had a you know was running a festival, cultural festival, an urban mm -hmm. arts festival, and you know. From that, uh, you know, a Shoko Festival happens once a year and you know, it brings together musicians, artists, graffiti artists, uh, uh, developers, bloggers. But there was a need to house them and to have a continuous process of, you know, like engaging with them. So yeah. that's how Motor Republic came to be as a home for creatives uh, continuously. And it was one of the first creatives creative hubs in the, in the country so it's uh, dedicated to uh, giving a space for creatives so a co-working space uh, because most creatives work, work from home like especially the freelancers they work from home and sometimes while you're working from home you don't have the opportunity to connect and collaborate with other people so you're in your own silo mm -hmm. so having a co-working space uh, enables you to have you know interaction with other people so like here we have Graphic designers, web developers, animators, you know, video videographers, and the collaborations that come out of there are all just organic. So, like, mm. the one guy makes a website for the graphic designer, the graphic designer right. makes logos for the video guys, and it's just, you know, an exchange of mm. skills, and then they're also helping each other in business, and mm. then one person has a client who requires services across the board, and then they bring that together, they form some sort of consortium, they pitch, they get the money, they split it. So yeah. it's like uh, contributing to the ecosystem and just realizing that, uh, yeah, you don't necessarily have to work from home. And also because there's the support part. Okay. <laughs> you know, always That's a big home. one. Right. You know, always <laughs> home. So you need someone with his uh, reliable internet and visa yeah. and, mm -hmm. and at an affordable fee. So not everyone can afford the, the, the packages that, that uh, internet service providers give. Yeah. So here they had those. The, the internet is subsidized, it comes with the, the package. Right.